I got a question. For the last few years, all we've heard from the right is Hunter Biden, Hunter Biden's laptop, Hunter Biden's laptop, Hunter Biden's laptop, Hunter Biden's addiction, the Biden crime family. Has anybody said exactly what laws Hunter Biden broke? What laws did Joe Biden break? Or is it just Hunter Biden, Hunter Biden's laptop, the Biden crime family? I know the one thing that Joe Biden has been accused of, and that is actual assault by Tara Reid. Y'all remember her? She came out of nowhere to accuse Joe Biden of actually assaulting her. It was proven to be a lie. She was caught up in lies. And now I believe she's actually moved to Russia and is living amongst the Russians. That's allegedly. I think I saw something. I don't know if it was a reputable source. I think I saw something. I do know now that Joe Biden is being accused of taking a $5 million bribe. That's from the Magadonians. And I told you all they do is a lie. So yeah, all I've heard them scream is Hunter Biden, Hunter Biden laptop, the Biden crime family. Joe Biden is a criminal, but they can never list specifics of what these crimes actually are however when it comes to their guy donald trump we can list the things that he's done we can start back in the 70s when uh the federal government filed a lawsuit against him for discrimination because he refused to rent to black people we can talk about that lawsuit that donald trump settled before he got into the White House regarding Trump University. Yeah, he settled for $25 million. His university was being accused of being fraudulous. And it was proven that it was fraudulous. He was sued and he settled out of court. Remember the Trump Foundation? Mm -hmm. supposed to be his charitable foundation and he was using the money raised through that foundation to fund his personal life didn't a judge order that foundation shut down and he nor his children can ever sit on the board of any charities yeah i remember that and then there was the trump russia scandal remember the Mueller investigation and remember once that report came out Bill Barr came out to basically invalidate the report but yet the report was so valid that Donald Trump ended up being impeached for it remember Ukraine Trump trying to blackmail Ukraine into investigating Joe Biden his political opponent Remember that? That was so brazen that that led to impeachment number two. The Trump Organization with Alan Weisselberg ended up taking the fall for tax fraud. Y'all remember that? Yeah, Alan took the fall for Donald Trump. He walked away scot-free on that. E. Jean Carroll just sued Donald Trump for actual assault it's way past the statute of limitations so criminal charges couldn't be brought but she was able to sue his ass she won he owes her five million dollars and then he goes on to try to defame her she getting ready to sue his ass again stormy daniels Stormy Daniels and that hush money payment. He paid her that money to keep her quiet while he was running for president. Remember that? Michael Cohen ended up taking the fall for that and went to jail. And Donald Trump 
ended up walking scot-free. Well, not scot-free. He getting ready to go to trial because his ass was indicted for that. And what we're dealing with now, Donald Trump just recently indicted for espionage, for stealing classified documents from the United States of America. Right. And we could talk about his children, Jared walking away from the presidency with two billion dollars from the Saudis. What is that about? Calls for investigation are happening in regards to that. Jared and Ivanka both walking away from the president with presidency six hundred million dollars richer. So, yeah. I think we should start asking when they scream Joe Biden and his crimes, the Biden crime family. I think we should ask, well, what were the crimes? What was he charged with? Let us know. We know what he was accused of, but what was he charged with and found guilty of? And then you can list all of the crimes that Donald Trump has been involved with and had to pay in some way, shape, or form, including these two indictments. That's all I got, y'all. Y'all have a fantastic day. Thank you for watching my video and please make sure that you're following me on YouTube, TikTok, Twitter, and Instagram.